The ink flows down into a dark puddle. What will it take just to find that special day? Oh shit. Hello, and welcome to a game called Home Safety Hotline. I'm kind of stoked to play this game. It seemed really cool. And yeah. So here we go. I literally know nothing about this. I want to preface this. I literally just saw Slimesicle played this, and I, I wanted to play it for myself. Mailbox. Welcome to Hosey Downline Family. We're pissed off for Hosey Downline Responder. Your supervisor's name is Carol Regina. She'll be calling you today to refill on your duties. You'll be reviewing your work maximum accuracy. As a reminder, uh, Responder is 90% accurate. We're qualified to receive a daily employee coupons. Hello. Video files on desktop. Attention, due to an error can so you know, so the video, uh, please ignore the, okay, whatever. Television commercial MV. oh, they literally just said this one worked, did they? Oh, no, there we go. Every year, thousands of families have, the, okay. Hazards such as house fires. Oh, boy, that doesn't look good. Flooding. I was a bit too loud there, flooding. Black mold. Metamorphosis. Don't become statistic. Call the Home Safety Hotline and keep your family safe. Okay. Home Safety Hotline. 555 Home Safety. Okay. Well, I guess we should just get going. Monday. Ah! Can I, like, decrease volume? Because holy shit, that is loud. You can shift, please clock in below. Clocking in. We're in the new digital age, baby. Uh, entries. Entry inaccessible. Entry inaccessible. Bed bugs. Bed bugs are small insects known for feeding on the blood of humans and other mammals, and their tendency to inhabit sleeping areas of the home. Homeowners infested with bed bugs often report itchiness. Uh, welcome. Welcome to Home Safety Hotline. Carol. My name is Carol, and I'll be acting as your supervisor during your time here at HSH. Before you begin your first day here, let me tell you a bit about how things work here. You are an HSH responder. As such, it is your job to learn about various household hazards so you can answer the questions of our callers intelligently. When a client calls, answer the call and listen carefully to their concerns. When you've diagnosed their issue, submit the corresponding household hazard and we'll forward them safety instructions to address their problem. Welcome to the HSH family. I'm sure we'll talk again soon. I guess we will. Okay. Uh, bed bugs are known as transmitting any diseases. Um, and relative harmless to humans. However, other persons could attract other pests. Uh, use them as a source solution. Bed bugs develop resistance to major pesticides, but therefore quite difficult to remove. Uh, it is advised to use our own pest. Wow, what do you know? Hello? John here. My wife insisted I call this number. It sounds like she thinks we might have some kind of infestation. My wife keeps telling me about specks of dirt or something in the kitchen. Just looks like coughing to me. I don't know. You tell me, I guess. Please hold. Black mold. It sounds like black mold. Uh, black mold is not going to go off. Okay, we should get small black spots somewhere. Small more specific for small energy creating problems. Black mold is not immediately able to cause the dust in the long term. The moist, warm locations that definitely sounds like a kitchen. Thinning supplies, maintenance, be okay. Submit answer. Uh, probably black mold. Did I, did I get it right, though? Is it right? Shit, no. Hi, I'm so sorry. My name is Grace, and it's probably nothing, but I thought I'd call just in case. Lately, I can't sleep at night because of this annoying little sound coming from my attic. Uh, it sounds kind of like... You know, it's it's probably nothing. I'm sure it could just be regular old house noises, but I just thought I'd call to ask and make sure. Uh, huh? 
I thought it was going to be... Bed bugs, but that doesn't sound like bed bugs. Is it a gopher? Uh, this is a for animals. Probably damaging gardens. Mice. Infestation. Ah, mole. Could be mole. No way, it's a mole. Okay, immediate... Raccoon. An addict! Ah, it's a raccoon. Can I search? I can't search. It's probably a raccoon. I think it's a raccoon. Did I do it right, though? You're not telling me if I'm doing it... If I did it right or not. Hank here. Hank. Well, last week I called your guys about some crap in my yard. Wait, wait, wait. I was told it wasn't anything to worry about. Well, guess what? There's more piles of crap in my yard. Jesus, man. I'm talking huge. Piles of brown out there. You better not tell brown me out there. nothing again, because I know I've seen something moving out there. Tell me what it is, so I can take care of it once and for all. I see. Please, I'll put you on hold, sir. If I'm not mistaken, there's a gopher. There's a mole, because I think moles mentioned something about making things. Uh, I, I, th I think the best thing I can give to him damaging yards, that's a gopher. Day! Hello, employee. Supervisor Carol here. We've received complaints that some of the answers that you have been providing have been inaccurate. Tell me that. You to think more carefully on the answers you provide before we are forced to terminate. You've been warned. You're not giving me good feedback. Give me good feedback. Ow! Okay, I definitely need to think more. Yeah. Similar. Sorry. I I thought I did well. Now I realize it's cockroaches. Yeah, no else gonna call me saying I've been doing a bad job. Oh, who's calling me this time, huh? Why does your image look like that? Get out of here. I think gophers are pleasant to look at. Let me see this guy. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Who is it? <clears throat> hey, sorry. I don't want to get anyone in trouble, but I called recently about some noises I was hearing, and the info I was sent seems to be incorrect, as I just found a family of mice in my attic. It was mice! I'm so sorry. I'm sure you folks get really busy and mistakes happen. Just thought I'd give you a, a Thank you. Thank you. Know. Thank you so much, Grace. You were so graceful about it. No one said they would be in the attic like raccoon was. They said raccoons could be in the attic. I got dipped. I was set up. What is this? Yeah, Jesus Christ. Hey, do you guys have a lawn mowing service or something? My good-for-nothing kid refuses to mow and it's getting real crazy out there. Looking like a rainforest over here. My kid is complaining about being too sick to do anything about it. Meh, 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 meh. The stress of this stupid lawn's giving me a headache just thinking about it. Can you guys can you send some guys up to get this done? Please hold.
I'm sorry, do we have something that's supposed to be good? Hey, wait, gophers. Collect the gopher. Who? Wait, can this get him sick? The only thing I can think to send this guy is a gopher. Cause what? Fuck it. Fucking terminate me if you want to. I'm sending this guy a gopher. I'm gonna put a gopher in a box and just send it directly to him. Fuck out of here, you piece of shit. I don't know what else to tell you. Your shift is ended. Accuracy, 0%. I got everything wrong. Complete your first day of... Safety hotline. I got literally everything wrong. What the hell? Is this a termination notice in the mailbox? Don't know me, but I have. But I used to have your job. You're in danger. Quit today before it's too late. You don't want to know. It's too late. Just trust me. Jesus Christ. How do I just quit? Can I just quit? Oh, this would be pretty sick if I could just quit. Tuesday. Tuesday, innit? Tuesday. Do I have more entries? Don't you dare fucking call me again, you piece of shit. Carol. Carol. Me, 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 Jesus Christ, Jeez, that scares me, because it's a perfect sign. Hello, it's Carol again, your supervisor. I'm calling to let you know that you have been granted access to additional household hazard information. The guy that's been getting everything wrong. This information is confidential and not to be shared with anyone outside of HSH. If you diagnose one of these hazards, we will be providing only information to the client that is pertinent to addressing their concerns. Nothing more. Thank you. Um, sorry to say this, lady, but I am kind of recording this. Oh, shit. Bat? She's non eternal flying animals. Bats can be identified with usually large ears, dark fur, most commonly found the way inside during homes during hibernation period before winter. Give me time to read. Hank here. That's strike two with you people. First, you tell me there's nothing. Then you send me the wrong information. Fuck you. I did what your info package Fuck said you. to do, and now there's even more critters in my yard. Tell They're me all what they want. staring at me now. They want me to. They want me to climb inside the tunnel. Bull. I, I must go inside. I must pay for my sins. What the fuck? Bad teeth. Bad either kind of household fungus and an overgrowing in small uh, cone like shapes in the underside of bad teeth. Blankets come from some of the bad teeth, open port mild. Just, oh, bad teeth. Over such as ticking, tickling, itching, or more rarely slimy acidic residue on their skin. Okay, got it. Carbon monoxide. Cellar growth? Ugh. Ugh. Sorry, I'm a. Mike. Uh, calling to see if you might know about anything I can do to... Who are you? Sorry. Uh, anything you can do to uh, prevent pollen from coming in the house? I think there's something seriously wrong with my ventilation or something, because I cannot stop sneezing. Uh, in the past, I haven't had problems so long as I've stayed inside, but I think something is getting in. Please hold Fuck. Okay, not that. Okay, what's a common hop? There, Jesus Christ. Okay, it's definitely not you two then. What the fuck's a desk hub? Ew. False beat? Yeah, it's not that. Fracture hub? Ugh. Frozen pipes. No. Definitely not a house fire, I can tell you that. Pipe growth? Pipe hob. Stair slug? Yeah. Okay, what was known to... I think it was black mold, wasn't it? Do I have a certain amount of time? If I do, fuck you. Born of must see allergic reactions and breathing problems. Oh, that might be it. 
I think that's my best chance. So I will submit black mold to you, sir. God, this better be right. What else could it be, though? Nothing else here is going to, like, start anything. Right? Mike, this better not be you again saying I was wrong. <laughs> hey, yeah, you back brain sent me some info when I was asking for some lawn care. Now my whole family's sick to our stomachs and itchy as all get out. <laughs> you should have said itchy before. You could have said itchy before. You didn't say exactly what your son was sick with. Who is it? Do you know if there's such a thing as house saves that clean? Like, maybe to disguise the robbery? At night, I keep hearing all this noise coming from my living room, but when I go look at it, I find the place spotless. But haven't yet found anything missing. I've talked with the cops, but uh, they keep telling me to call this number. So here I am. Is there something you can do? Hop, 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 hop. Come and hop. Yes, it's a common hob. Did you really come out at night? Yes. Metamorphosis? Jesus Christ. I know for a fact I got that one right. Look at this little, look at this little thing. Look at this guy. Look at this fucking weirdo. I don't want to look at you anymore. I like mold. It's disgusting. I don't want to look at bed teeth. I don't want to think about that. Bats are, okay, bat, bats are cute. Let me look at the bat. Hey, look at him. Look at this little guy. Yeah. Yeah. to give him anything. <clears throat> I'll play wrestling. Oh, is this... I... I don't know what's going on inside my house. I hear something crawling in the walls. I think I found teeth marks on my bedposts. I can't sleep at night knowing there's something in my house. Help me, please! What the... Please hold. Can you tell me what the bite marks look like? Okay, you said it bit... Your that your your bed. So I'm starting to think that's a fracture hob. Teeth marks on my bed post. The only other thing I could think it'd be is a rat or a mouse. No marks, no sounds of squeaking. Okay, fuck it, I'm gonna go with the mouse. I think it's a mouse. I mean, gnaw marks? That has to be it. Teeth marks on the bedpost. Yeah, no, that, that has to be a fucking mice. Right, it has to be. I'm still worried it's a fracture. Yeah, hey, I'm calling about a noise I've been hearing in my house lately. Sounds like scratching or something. It's real quiet, so definitely some kind of pest in my walls. I've sent out all kinds of traps, but uh, I thought one worked for a while, but then I started hearing it again this week. I thankfully haven't seen any visible damage or droppings or whatever. Something making noise, but it doesn't Please hold. leave any visible dropping. Okay, so we know it's not that. Mice will leave dropping, so we know it's not that. Maybe it's a house spider somehow? No, web sighting. No, they didn't hear a gopher somehow. Maybe it's a... No. 
He just notices weird noises, doesn't it? You're hearing scratching or squeaking? Scratching. My man, that is literally the best thing I have for you. I have literally nothing else that I think this could be. Hopefully he'll call back and tell me if he's right or not. Anywho. Wait, hold on. Was this very faint scratching? I guess. I don't really know. Oh, shit. That, to me, seems like a desk hub. That one was pretty easy. Oh, 80% accuracy! 80%! That's 80% better than yesterday! How oh, wonderful. Wait, your second... This game's gonna have a lot of waiting, so you're gonna get a lot of me singing. <laughs> oh, broadcast. Oh, no. something in this image. Oh my god, that was very loud. Sorry. You can hear my knuckles cracking. Oh no. Twelve thousand dollars for that house? I'm not scared of analog horror. It's too late for you now. They gave you access to more info, didn't they? I wanted you. I warned you. If you end up like me, joining me in this hole, they haven't found me yet. It's safe here. No one cares. Uh, just network girls. Okay, that's not too bad. Anyway, let's get to our, uh, job. <clears throat> Wednesday. Clock in, baby. Clock in. Not giving me access to anything new, huh? Also, I couldn't quit, man. Hello, Supervisor Carol here again. We've updated your permissions. You should now have access to more extensive information to work with for your future calls. Please be sure to read these new entries carefully so you can continue providing our clients with accurate diagnoses. I just realized something. Please remember that this information is strictly confidential and not to be shared with anyone unless pertinent to a caller's needs. 
Thank you. This is Bert's been to my caller's needs. Anyway, I'll show you some. What if someone calls in beforehand? With like a few of this shit. Bogart? That's not creepy at all. Hey there, Bogart. False thing. More false item. Hey, yeah, thanks a bunch for the terrible advice you sent me. My kid just fell through the frickin' wall from all the damage they dealt, and we found out on our own what was going on. What was See it? Never. But what was it, Fred? Fuck you, Bogart. Uh, false artifact. I don't know if I'm making buzzing sound, but you're a very young human children or small animals. Missing children or pets. That's great. False rosebush. Oh. So this is this is where the kid was missing. Okay. Oh, I see. There's something in the basement. I've seen it. It's huge, almost as big as my dog. It doesn't hiss or growl or anything, but I haven't gotten close enough to it to find out what it is since it's always just lurking out of sight from the top of the stairs. I need someone to come get this thing out of my basement as soon as possible. I've locked the door since I can still hear the steps creaking under its weight down there. Please hold. Definitely not that. Anyway, it's a memory wisp mirror nymph. Good to know about that. T sprite. Oh, is this a stair slug? Never mind. Toilet hub. Ewe. Okay, immediately I'm thinking it's the thing that's in the um the basement. What was it called? Oh, so oh, it's all the way up at C. Cellar growth. Sound of dripping, stretching your strange clothes. Uh, uh, never mind. It's hiding in the bit. Hold on. Something that's huge. It's almost as big as my dog. It doesn't hiss or growl or anything. We've gotten close enough to find out. It's always working. Just got a switch from the top of the stairs. Um. Something almost as big as your dog. What type of dog do you have? That would actually be really helpful if you could tell me what type of dog you have. I got nothing for you besides that damn cellar growth, so. Sorry, David. I don't know what else it could be. It's definitely not Bogart. He's way too tall. Look at this guy. Yeah, six to seven feet tall. In a way, it's Bogart. Nothing here, though, is as big as a dog. Unless it's a type of hob. Hey, uh, Bader. I've been hearing some really weird noises coming from the bathroom faucet recently. I'm not <gasps> sure what it could mean. It just makes this nasty sound anytime I run it, along with this, uh, nasty smell. I remember something about that. Give me Please a second, sir. Hold. Yes, it is a frozen pipe. This for some reason reminds me a lot of Papers, Please, and I don't know why. No Papers, Please. It was recording screen. Maybe I'm on observation duty. It's sort of like a version of that, but from your own home. They tell you what's wrong, and then you... Report it. Hello. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. It's gone. My wife. Oh, my God. I can't see her face. I can't see her face. She's dead. I can't see her face. They're all gone. It's all gone. Oh, my God. Please hold. Oh, my God. I, I'm tearing up a little bit. Jesus, man. Oh, my God. That's so sad. The mirror nymph seems like it'd be the only thing to steal. Or maybe a memory wisp? He said he can't see her face. But she also says he's, she's dead. Okay, I think my best answer for this man is the, the, what was it called again? Memory Wisp. That's the only thing I can think of. 
He remembers that he has a wife and that the person next to him is her, but he doesn't remember what her face looks like. That's the, literally the only thing I think could be. Right? Like, what else could it be? It's not Bogart. Imagine you woke up and Bogart was in bed with you. That'd be pretty dope. That'd be pretty dope. Jesus Christ. Hello? Hey, yeah, name's Fred Pinball. I'm calling to lodge a complaint against your place of business. I have never seen such a big old mess left behind by your pest control team. Just tons of twigs, sticks, and pebbles. Sod, and I ain't putting up with it no more. I got sawdust coming out of my drawers here. I had to grab you by the goober and smack you around till next Sunday. Now, what you gonna do? What you gonna do to make this right? Why? <laughs> grab you by the goober. He's gonna grab me by the goober. God. Who is it? It's horrible. I followed your instructions, but it's not what you said it would be. I think it's angry at me. I hear it slithering this way. No! I hear it slithering. I didn't read the full thing. I need to read. What the fuck? Uh, Harvey, you fucking I, nerd. I uh have no idea what's happening. Hey. My sheets are growing nasty, sharp things on them, and my legs itch like crazy. Do I need to be showering more often or something? I usually shower like once a week for my skin health, so maybe that's it? No, you're good, man. Can you, like, make this go faster? Please hold. I know exactly what that is. That's dead teeth, though, man. So if I go into... Is there a way to make tech speed faster? Is there, like, a tech speed? Not tech size. No, not even tech speed. Arachnophobia, fear of the dark. So I'm gonna turn that on. I have both those fears, so I'm just gonna turn those on now. Oh, is it brightening up the images? Might be brightening up those darker images. Hello? I was told to call this number to ask about my problem. The wall in my bedroom doesn't look right near the bottom. The bottom of the wall has some cracks, or maybe it's peeling? I'm not sure. Peeling? I have a cat named Whiskers, and sometimes he likes to sharpen his claws at the couch. But he would never do that to the wall. He knows just how naughty that would be. I know what you mean. I have a cat and he does the same thing. But through beds. Please hold. Um. Oh, wait. This image isn't available anymore. Oh, is it just getting rid of images? That would, like, make those fears a reality? You yeah, know, like, Tom and Hob and... Okay, Tom and Hob's gone. I think it's because it was looking at me. Oh, because Cellar Gross for a dark image. Okay, so yeah, no. I'm fine with that, though. Um... So that means it's probably the Fracture Hob, right? Also, I passed F. What else was it that could peel? Or maybe it's Termites. Oh, it's totally Termites. There you go, lady. I will admit that image of Bogart was creeping me out. So I'm, I'm glad it's fucking gone. Do you think this is some kind of joke? Last week, Whoa. I called you guys about some weird noises I had coming from my living room. And the info package you sent me said something about leaving out a bowl of cream? What kind of joke is that? I'm sorry, what? It's been a week now that I've been dealing with this racket, no thanks to you, and now we're starting to have power outages. 
your employee's stupid joke is now probably going to cost me who knows how much in repair costs. So talk to your manager and tell them they owe me big time. You figure out what's going on in my house and you figure it out now! That wasn't even me, man. I'll put you on hold, though. Please hold. So, power outages. Was that Bogart? Sorry, man, you got a Bogart on your hands. There you go. <laughs> what the fuck is that accuracy? 83.33334%. Yeah, I accidentally got David killed. Wednesdays, am I right? Science mysteries. That MV. That movie. What the fuck is this? Uh-oh. Mice. One of humanity's oldest friends and oldest enemies. From the Black Plague to the shelves of our pet stores, mice have lived alongside humans for centuries. And just like humans, mice may even be evolving alongside us as well. Yeah, they are. Are you kidding me? This is a mus musculus, otherwise known as the common house mouse. And this is Mus musculus loquentis, otherwise known as the smart mouse. The a newly smug? species known for its uniquely colored iris, and more importantly, its increased intelligence. Mice have brains smaller than peanuts, and yet modern science has observed they are capable of thinking quite intelligently. And in the case of the smart mouse, perhaps even capable of communication. With the help of modern computer technology, today's scientists have been able to interpret the previously indecipherable squeaks of a smart mouse and have discovered what seems to be squeak, squeak. messages. Squeak, squeak, squeak. Within. Let's take a listen. Looks great. That was a that was a grown ass man. What do you think? Is this a wonder of evolution? No, that or was a grown ass just man. Just hearing things that aren't there. Do mice and men have more in common than that's previously a book. thought? Well, I suppose that's what makes this pretty racist science book. mystery. No, that was just the grown ass man. I think he just put his own voice over the fucking box. Our new office pet? Oh, it's a cat. Whiskers! Whiskers is a little funny. Is it serious? Well, let's go. Please give Whiskers a warm up. I'm wondering about your desk. Whiskers are on the office. He has scheduled feeding times. Look at him. Oh, that's an adorable little cat. We'll do one more. We'll do up to Thursday. Thursday! God. Aha. Call me, Carol. Carol, I ain't playing your games. Call me, Carol. Carol, I swear to fucking God. In my head, I'm gonna write a poem of me and you. Ah, there we go. In case you're wondering, I literally just played the DLC before this. Hello, Supervisor Carol here again. I've been watching the closely employee. The. I'm impressed so far by your dedication to accuracy. 
I have once again updated your permission so you should have access to more extensive household hazard information. Thank you. Keep up the great work, employee. Our eyes rest upon me. The fuck's with that language? I'm sorry. Attic gnome? Cellar grotto. I thought I told you how to fear of the dark. Whatever. Fay feast. Fay flu. I think the map is something wrong with our faucet. Recently, I've been having the worst kind of stomach bug, just aches and pains constantly. But after a month, still hasn't gone away, and I'm thinking there's got to be something wrong with the water, because. We only eat fresh, homegrown fruits and vegetables here, and we ain't ever had any problems until now. I keep hearing things about rusted pipes and water poisoning and all kinds of terrible things that can happen to the water, so can you just send someone out to get this fixed for us? Man, apparently we have everything. Please hold it. It ain't the water. You got a false beat on your hands. What the fuck's the fey flu? Oh, apparently I can't see. Apparently it must be dark or they're looking at me. Floor roots? These things? Oh, this thing. The horde. Laundry gnome? The police told me to call Jesus, this Felicia. number, so I, uh, hope I got the right number here. You did. Anyway, uh, I think, I think somebody is stalking me. Oh, Jesus. I can see their shadow at night at my window, just That's staring Bogart. into the house. When I close the window, I can still hear him out there, breathing. I've been sleeping on the couch every night this past week, just so he won't see me. Do you not have any windows the in your living room? said they can't do anything, so please, send somebody or do something what about What the fuck's this. wrong with the police? I can hardly sleep anymore. Okay, no, the police should entirely do something about that, but if I'm not mistaken, that is Bogart at his little shenanigans once again. While they sleep. Yeah, no, if they're, if he's looking at you while you sleep, man, that's Bogart. Was your house absurdly clean before this guy started showing up? That would be helpful information. What the fuck's a laundry gnome? Anyone could see it. Hello, Belinda? Yes, I believe there may be some kind of problem with our home ventilation. Lately, we've been hearing awful banging noises coming from the ceiling, and the air quality seems to have been drastically reduced. My daughter hasn't been able to stop coughing. Fuck. Please, how old? Uh, good night now. Oh, wait a minute. Fuck, I just killed that woman. Oh. I think it's the uh, attic gnome. Man, I should have I should have looked at everything I had. That that woman totally got killed by that gnome. Which one? Uh The night gnome. Yeah, this one. He's he still got killed by this kid. Jesus 
Jesus Christ, this place you. sucks. So please say you can help. What happened? My, my little boy, Jeremy, has gone missing. He's eight years old and such a sweetheart. Oh my God. Okay, we're getting this right. We're getting this shit right. Oh my god, I'm I'm literally tearing up. Oh my god. Okay, okay, what's something that's known to steal kids? Um, for, for one. The, uh, where is he? Where is he? Where is he? The bush guy. Travel number, are you known? Uh, what was that one guy? What else could have kidnapped this kid? Bogart, did you do this shit? God, I I, I want to get this kid back. What could, okay, hold on, bees. Let's look at the bees tab. Okay, which thing can be attracted by bees? It's definitely not you two. You two don't tend to kidnap kids. Okay, flu? No. So if I have the false artifact. Oh wait. Oh my god, it's the false artifact. The kid's scared of bees and he heard a buzzing noise. <gasps> Fucking get that kid back. Get that kid back. God, that that woman's message genuinely made me tear up. That hurt. Holy shit. Please tell me, please tell me she got her kid back. I need to know. Hi. I'm concerned somewhat about the stability of my new home. I recently finalized the purchase and naturally afterwards found that there are several large cracks in the walls of the basement that were not previously disclosed. The basement. As well as several pieces of half-eaten cheese littered across the basement floor. I haven't been able to get in contact with the previous owners about this and I'm wondering if Happy you can offer any kind of legal Happy advice. cheese? Does something just happen to your image? Please. Oh, oh. happy and cheese. The horde? Would the horde do this? Um, okay, so let's look at the things that we know. Okay, fracture hop. Uh, the foundation of that kind of also get forged. I think we found it is. I think all the happy and cheese is from uh, the previous homeowners. Putting out the cheese for the happy and for putting out the cheese for the fracture hub. <sighs> okay. God, I hope that kid's okay. I know he's fictional, but still, it, it, it pains me to see that. Like, anytime I hear about any sort of loss, I immediately just get teared up, man, because it's such an awful thing. Who do we got? Hey, hello there. There. Good night, God, Rober. Party. He's Canadian. Party. Guys, I got the pepper squeeze. That again. We got this time. Bill. Hey, so my doctor told me I should call Jesus him. Christ, everyone here sucks. I have no idea why he won't tell me anything. He said you could help, so here goes nothing, I guess. Um, here goes nothing. So I've recently been having just the worst headaches, and headaches. Really, I woke up and felt my eyes were starting to look kind of pink. I'm really freaked out right now, and I'm not sure what I have. Damn, your doctor I can't sucks. Find anything online. Can you help me? 
Immediately, for some Please reason, I it. thought that could be carbon monoxide. Wait, network error, what? Network error? Is this... You're giving me a memory game here? My memory is awful! Fuck, okay. Um... Mm, what could get you sick easily? Quite a bit of black mold. Eh, it's good to be the fake flu. The fake flu. Ah, fuck it. I don't know what else it could be, so we're giving them the fake flu. Do that shit. My internet's down. Is everything back in order yet? Nope. I'm fucked for the rest of this time, aren't I? Can't even hear the audio samples. Do you mind, uh... You know, restoring... You gotta tell me what's going on inside my home, okay? I'm freaking out over here! Jesus, okay, what's going on? Holes. I'm stepping around big wooden splinters. There's no telling how much damage there is. I've got this big gaping one in my kitchen that I have no idea how freaking deep it goes. To top it all off, my skittish little greyhound goblin is nowhere to be found. She probably took off after seeing this mess. I need help. That's a fracture. And Isn't that a fracture? Please hold. Oh, okay, we're back to doing normally. Okay, is that a fracture? Pressure hub? Don't they leave holes? No. Which one's- Okay, thank god. Okay, hold on. So I gave him the fake flu, is that right? Oh, I- I just got a rich- Oh my god, I got it fucking right. Okay, well, let's see. What could lead to big holes? Also, he said he saw one of these guys, so it's probably one of these. Can you provide more information, or is it just holes? Maybe a cellar grotto? There's holes in my freaking house. Big one holes, man. Big gaping one in my kitchen. Greyhound goblin. Special greyhound goblin is nowhere to be found. A related pests. Okay, fuck it. My best thing you got here, man, is a cellar grotto. That literally is my best guess. Do it that way, you will. What the fuck? Who's calling me? Jackie! Alright, I'm gonna need someone to explain what in the name of Christmas is happening to my living room. I'm back from vacation and the house is already turning into a disaster not 24 hours later. And my living room is absolutely covered in soil and plants looks like a gosh darn nursery in there what is happening is is this what happens when you buy a bad rug or something soil please hold immediately i'm thinking of that weird thing that we saw earlier the um it was, it was isolated you Okay, what about that weird, like, um... That would come into your house? It was weird. What was it called again? It was a worm of some sorts? Low roots. Fucking load. Ah. Found it. You got yourself a travel gnome. I am doing so good, guys. Anything else got on the agenda today, or is it time to clock out? Time to clock out. Time to clock out, okay.
How many more calls do I have today? Well, I got good news and bad news. Bad news is the info you sent wasn't any help at all, so, uh, think so. thanks for that. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Good news is I found Goblin. She freaking came crawling out of that hole with a big bump on her head or something, so I'm taking her to the vet now. But, uh, yeah, Goblin was your it, I guess. dog? Oh, he did say Greyhound. I thought he was just being rude to the Goblin. Okay, well, it's clearly a termite then, right? It's a small holes in drywall. No, no, that was very confusing. You should have been more obvious that Goblin was a dog, even though you did call it a Greyhound. The info. The info you sent. No good. Can't sleep while it's watching me. I can't. I can't. It's... it's still out there, little creep. Can you... can you... wait, no, I know what it is now. I know what it is. It's one of the fucking gnomes. Which gnome was it? It was... Night Gnome. Yeah, that's right. I'm sorry, lady. Don't be another person already called Larry. There's something... There's something in my basement. I don't know what it is. All I know is when I open my basement door, it smells like a damn sewer, and I can hear it making all kinds of horrible noises. It sounds like there might be a lot of water down there, too. I don't know what it might that be. That would be a stellar grotto. There, but I have a feeling it's causing a whole lot of damage. Please, send somebody to help with this. I can't deal with something like this. Yeah, most people can't. Please hold. That to me sounds like a cellar grotto. Maybe not. Okay, so he's... From the basement, he's hearing a bunch of wet noises. It's making a strange noise. You hear something down in your basement. It smells like a sewer. So this one, this one, not that one, this one. Smell. Yeah, fuck it. You got yourself a cellar grotto on your hands, man. Go down there with a flashlight and see what's down there. Tell me if it looks like a grotto. Thank you. I, I think I believe I at least got the kid right. The one with the kid. That one's my main priority for that one. This is gonna be a five nights thing. Like five, five nights only. Five nights at Freddy's. It's in the mailbox. Do not come to the hall. The hall is breached. I repeat. The hall is breached. It is not safe here. I must find a new spot. It knows I'm here. Reading insurance is your church. We need to come to work this Saturday. So anything we need to buy a rest of will be recognized. Additional labels will be recognized. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I probably will do a part two on this game. Because right now, I do not have the time to continue going. But I hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one. Uh, hold on, I need to pull up, need to pull up this one so I can end my recordings at the same time. Uh, peace. Yeah.